In this video, we will download and run a sample for MapSuite Web for Web API from our GitHub repository. To start, we navigate to the MapSuite main page of our wiki and click on Web for Web API. Here we have a table of contents for easy navigation. We're going to click Learning Samples and then click Explore and Study All Learning Samples Now. Again, you can see in our table of contents, we have links to a lot of samples, but for this sample, we're going to choose the Quick Start sample. From our GitHub repository, we will click on Clone or Download, and then click Download Zip. We navigate to where it was saved and extract the file. Open the folder, and then open the solution in Visual Studio. Once the solution is loaded, you can see that we need to restore our references due to the yellow caution symbol next to them. To do so, we right-click on References, then click Manage NuGet Packages. At the top of the Package Manager, you can see a yellow alert letting us know that we need to restore our packages. From here, we click Restore, and after a brief moment, we refresh the Solution Explorer to see that the yellow caution symbol has gone away, and our packages have been restored. Next, we right-click the default.html and choose Set a Start Page. Now we can start our application. The product center will load and prompt us for our account information. If you don't have an account, you can create a new account here with the create a new account link. We enter our information and click login. Our trial activation is complete. The product center contains a great list of resources to samples, documentation, screenshots, and more. To get back to the product center, you can access it from the bin folder of this project. We click Continue Debugging, and our map sample will load and is complete. Thank you for watching.